Ground check face. Okay, let's go and see if the grounds are safe. Look at this garden. It's beautiful. A little long in the grass, but it's beautiful. But what am I looking for? What am I checking for? Am I checking for, like, rocks? Am I checking for bugs? Am I checking for toys? I don't know what I'm looking for. Hello? There's gotta be something here. So, oh, 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 I see something over there. Hello? What are you? You are a newspaper. You know, usually I just, like, run this over, but I'll pick it up if that's what the job requires. We've got three minutes and 30 seconds to complete my grounds check. No, oh, oh, there's something there. It looks like a tennis ball. You know, I think everybody has run over a tennis ball. If you've had a dog, you've definitely run over a tennis ball. I've had multiple dogs growing up, which means multiple tennis balls. And if you smack a tennis ball with a lawnmower, it's actually kind of funny. What's this here? That looks like a, a shovel, a spade. Don't need to run those over. Cause a lot of damage to your thing. Oh, oh, that's why I'm doing this. I'm trying to like not let my lawnmower get damaged. And that's kind of important. Cause I spent a lot of euros on that. A whopping 250 euros. And the last thing we need to do is allow that thing to get damaged. Now it's saying to return to my vehicle. All right, I'll just listen to the job. You sprint? Oh, I could sprint. I gotta sprint this whole time. Thanks, game. You have one job. All right, so first we gotta turn on the vehicle because I'm really good at this kind of thing. And then we gotta throw the throttle down like that. And then we get off that lovely little thing. Look at that beautiful car. That is a gorgeous vehicle. Don't mind me. I might run into it later. I'm not saying that I'm mean. I'm just saying that, you know, I kind of like it. Now we want between five and six. We got six and then we gotta turn on the motor. Look at that baby purr. Listen to her hum. First person view. Let's have some fun. Now, apparently we, we're timed on this. We have to do a good job. Contract performance. Your performance during cutting will affect how much money you make. That's great. Um, if I accidentally run over your flowers, don't, don't worry about it. They're just flowers. So first things first, ladies and gentlemen, whenever you are mowing lawns, you must complete a perimeter, right? Kind of like if you're in the military, you got to do a perimeter check. Look at me go. Hopefully this is, oh, this bush. Um, push, push. Oh, oh I scratched my face up like crazy. This is why you wear protective face shields. Whenever you're out in the field, men, put on your face shields. Protect your eyes, protect your nose, protect everything. These flowers look like they need a good mow. And maybe when we're almost on the job, maybe we'll uh, give the flowers a bit of a trim. Give the bushes a bit of a trim. Well, so far, so good. So far, my driving skills are great. I haven't slanted anything. I haven't cut any flowers. In fact, one would say I was born to do this. I was born to be a man. Born to be fantastic. Born to be a handsome, strapping young lad. Stretching his arms out in glory as he carefully tries to turn this corner. Nailed it! <laughs> Voila, perimeter check complete. And now we shall do another round. Don't reverse onto the flowers. Don't worry. Whoa. Whatever beautiful lines I was trying to create have been completely ruined. Oh, I don't know why I haven't done this view earlier. This is actually, uh, this is actually a lot easier. Minus the fact that the giant trees overhead are getting in my eyes. Look at this. This is beautiful. This is relaxing. This is everything you could ever want as a man. The manliest man who ever manned. Hey, does this lawnmower have a beer holder? Anyone know a uh, place to put my drink so I can drink while I work, which is just terrible. This is a life. This is happiness. This is everything you could ever want. Jessica Lee driving along. The beautiful weather. If I had some poppin' tunes right now, this would be fantastic. Or a nice podcast or, or something. God, I sound like dad. Ugh. I can see why they give you 30 minutes to complete this level because this is taking a fair while. Is this what gaming has become? Doing things in a virtual world that we would never want to do in real life. So I gotta say, driving one of these things would probably be kind of fun in real life if I ever own a lawn that's any bigger than what I have now. I might get one of these fancy schmancy machines. In fact, I want this exact model. Can somebody tell me where I can find this exact model? Is that the one on Amazon? eBay. You know what this game needs? The turbo button. 
It needs something for the straightaways. You want to slow down for the corners, right? You slow it down for the corner. Oh my god, I get the corners. But for a straightaway, like this whole stretch, all this, I need a turbo button. I gotta go fast. A whole lot faster than I'm going right now. Just a man in his mower, enjoying the weather, enjoying the silence. No little children, no wife, nothing. Just me, my mower, and Mother Nature as I slowly kill her children. You're her little grass children here. Oh my god, I can't drive. Who gave me my license for lawn mowing? What's that? There is no lawn mower license? Well, I've learned something today. I've learned that anyone, regardless of ability, regardless of circumstance, can do what I do. And that makes me feel very not special. <laughs> you gotta be real, I feel very unspecial right now. I thought I was a beautiful butterfly, a unique creature, the only man that could mow, but apparently not. Apparently I'm not unique. You know, all this time spent on this lawnmower has given me time to think. That's dangerous. You don't want me thinking. Weird things happen when I think, because right now I'm contemplating the very nature of existence. What is this universe? Why are we here and why can't I drive in a straight line? I am terrible. What would happen if I threw the Earth into a supernova? Would the Earth explode? I mean, logically it would. But what if I armored the Earth with super titanium alloy something or other? Could we ever survive a supernova? These are the things I think when I've got the time. Someone, for the love of God, put me out of my misery. Okay, let's just nice and tight here on the garden. Don't run over the flowers. That's at the end of the cut time. When we've completed our job and the game's like, good job, here's your money. At that point, I'm going to run over every single flower in this garden. And it shall be glorious. Though if anyone was actually judging my skills right now, all they'd have to do is look around all the spots that I've missed and go... Bro. And I've been like, what, what? I'm trying my hardest. I'm doing my best. What? Calm down. Get off my back. What are you doing about it? And I, I don't know where the accent came from. I apologize. Let's get in here in the entrance. I'd feel really bad if I left that alone. If I didn't finish the job and make it look at least kind of pretty through there. But you don't want to be stepping on the long grass. Get to your nice short grass over here. And now we're going to do this little circle overly kind of bit here. Give this a beautiful cut. I don't want to turn too tight because I know what will happen. I might mark up the grass with my my muddy tires, which is terrible. You damaged the ground. No, this is what happens when you turn too tight, guys. Ah, uh, damage the ground. Well, the f joke's on them. I'm going to be damaging a lot more than that when all is said and done. A lot more than that. If I kiss the ground better, will that fix things? All right, kids, back to work. Did I say graphically? They've done a good job. The grass blowing in the wind. It's kind of pretty. Not going to lie, it looks really good. Mm, I think we should do this bit over here. Yeah. I've been at this for almost 10 minutes, and I'm not going to lie. Time has kind of flown by. There's something beautiful. There's something relaxing. There's something almost therapeutic about cutting grass. I can see why my dad would love this. And my dad's always like, Son, one day in the distant future. And I'm always like, Dad, why are you talking about that? And he would respond to this, One day in the distant future. And I roll my eyes and then he would continue on. You will enjoy cutting grass like a man. I usually responded with Dad. You don't have to talk like that. He's like, Like a man. And now here I am talking in that voice, Like a man. Mowing the grass. Enjoying the, the, little, the little simple things. In there. Oh, yeah. Getting to the end. You're almost there. Look at this beautiful lawn. 90% complete. We're coming to the end now. This is the end game. Where's, where's Iron Man? We need him. Tight turn. Tight turn. Don't damage the lawn. Don't damage anything. Tight turn. Apparently, this is a very easy map. I'm kind of scared to know what a difficult map is going to look like. Am I going to have to get, like, the, the weed whacker and the, the lawn care stuff and maybe some fertilizer and some weed killer. Am I going to turn into like a full-on lawn care professional by the end of this? Will I be able to take care of my own lawn? Is this just teaching me life lessons? Or am I learning that, hey, cutting grass. It's kind of nice. I saw a strip to my right that I missed. I must defeat it. Oh, I see a little strippy strip here. Apparently, I'm not so good on these turns. Apparently... I've made some mistakes. Let's just go tight here. 
tight, 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 tight like that. Look at these scripts. See this? Look at this. What is this? Who did that? Is that me? Can it be me? I'm a professional. I'm a perfectionist. I am the best. How would I ever dare make these mistakes? And why do I continue to just do laps around this garden? Oh, I just want to run over all these flowers so badly. Let's just continue on. 97%. 98%. We are looking fabulous, guys. I think this last pass will be enough. And then I might have um I might have a word with our garden. Wasn't there a strip here? There's strip. Got it! Cleaned it! Didn't even like do a tenth of a percentage. Well fine then. Let's finish off the worst of this. Finish off the thickest. 90. Oh! Cutting complete! With the cutting complete, you now need to drive back to the trailer to leave location! Oh, we've done it. And now, now it's time to do damage. <laughs> Plant, use word of flower, finding curd. How, how, how many finds? How many finds can I incur? <laughs> I will destroy every flower on this property. You don't pay me enough $37 an hour. Look at these beautiful tall lilies. Goodbye. Oh, there's so many flowers. There's so many things to cut. I'm actually kind of shocked at how many things there are to cut in this game. I can't cut the bushes, but I can cut the flowers. Beautiful flowers, beautiful flowers. Also, what happens if I like, run over things? Can I cause more damage to my vehicle? Oh, no, it just, this is all for scientific measures. I, I need to know. I need to see just how much damage we can cause. <laughs> oh, I'm going to do donuts. Yeah, we're gonna do donuts on the property. This is beautiful. The mayhem is causing. Yes. Oh, what if I lower the cut height? Lower the cut height. Yeah, now we're cutting it too much. We're cutting the grass far too low. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I can move the benches. Oh, I can cause some mayhem here. These flowers are beautiful, 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 beautiful. So much destruction. What about off the property? What if I what if I ran into like your beautiful chair over here? It's great. <laughs> I'm stuck in the chair. <laughs> I can't <laughs> take in the chair with me. Ah <laughs> yes. Oh, put the chair in the gardens. Cut these grasses. Oh, it's beautiful. Get off me, chair, ruining everything. I can't turn. This stupid chair gets in my way. Oh, the fines are gonna be delicious, guys. I can't wait to see the damage. Fines are gonna be great. The amount of damage I'm causing to my vehicle is gonna be fantastic. Oh, there's a car there. Hey, hey, do you, do you want my services, mister? I mean, look at how good of a job I'm doing cleaning out these gardens, right? You want to hire Mr. Crojack, uh, mow, mow your face down, Incorporated. Hey, ma'am, ma'am, do you like my mowing job? <gasps> Can I learn to people? Can I mow people over? Oh, look at the extra little strippies I'm doing here. Look, you see the extra, like, low sections in the grass? It's fantastic. How about a couple donuts? And then let's go run over some people. I mean, what's the worst of that? I'm just gonna run over some people. Over. And donut time. Gotta put some of that dare dirt bath. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, majestic. I'm making crop circles to summon the aliens. And then right here, another beautiful crop circle. Where, where, where's my crop circle? Penalty, damage to the ground, fine incurred. I'm trying to make a crop circle and the game won't let me. Okay, fine, I'll go this way. What about that beautiful, old, expensive looking car? Kabam! Oh, come on. No message, I'm not scraping the side of this car, nothing. Oh, I'm doing work to this thing and nothing's happened to the car, I'm so disappointed. And that's a beautiful trailer, but well, what if I don't want to go on the trailer? What if I just want to go this way? Can I bust through? the gates please let me out please let me out i want to see the cars let me out no also i'm a little bit disappointed that it won't let me out of the vehicle like i can't escape i'm hitting every single key it's not letting me out i am now permanently stuck in this thing i think our work here is done let's see how bad the fines are vehicle condition blade condition i've done some damage to our vehicle oh, look, at the floor. look at the property Oh, we've done good work here today, guys. We have done such good work. Flowers are cut down, dirt paths in the grass, multiple different levels and heights. It's fantastic. And now we see the damage. What are our fines? Penalties and fines. I almost got into negative 
dollars. Two hundred and twenty-four dollars of flowers destroyed. Fifty-six dollars of collisions. Incorrect cut height, guys. I didn't do a bad enough job. I should I should have paid them to let me destroy their property that much.